What do you see, Sunan? Rolo's men, caged like plump hens. Hey! <sighs> 
you, my friend. Let's give the ravens a feast of Saxon blood! Come, my wolves! Valhalla awaits us! My sword will bring you sleep!
Aid me. Be my eyes. Must be blocked from the other side.
Now we discuss the terms of the kidnap. Your axe arm is strong, Rolo. Never doubt me, Raven Feeder. These Saxon king slaves did. You showed great loyalty to your kinfolk. Stay true to that, and your name and deeds shall spread far. Good advice. Such is my fiercest desire. If it's renown you want, then aid me now. I have a task that will set your name ringing through the long halls. Oh, tell me. I need someone with a swift wave steed in good repair to bring the Lady Estrid across the sea to Frankia. Another kidnap scheme. Estrid is unshakable. All right, then. Let we two triumph where one failed. I need you stout-hearted in this, whatever your passions for Estrit. We had our time together. Now that's done. I will not fail you here, nor her. We will meet with your men inside Colchester, on the night of the Lama's Festival.
my loins wither with waiting. Will Olvida remember a lover from so long ago? Would I? Been eating fish. Be my eyes soon. Last house in Malden. All of it should be here. What about?
You have my sister! Is that not enough? Peace, boy. I'm not with these men. I came to speak with your sister, that's all. A day in Essex. Now here's a day riddled with strange portents and happenings. Why did they take your sister? Some of Alfred's men beat a child of the village for stealing bread. My sister would not stand by and see injustice done. Do you know where they're holding Alvida? Yet another stay at the King's pleasure. The prison camp at Brentwood, far to the west. I'll bring her to the lake house north of there. Meet us there if you wish. If you promise you will find her, I will. Survey the area, Sunan. Yeah. 
ankle ladder is flattened on then. I swear, Athena is never. What? Dark spirits torment this land. Do you see?
This must be Beerston's love, Alveda. They haven't broken her spirit. I will need to find a key.
Unlock Alvida's cage. to free you. I cannot walk. My ankle. They were not gentle with me. Then I will carry you. Who are you? Who risked so much to save me? A friend. Of Elridge's? Is he all right? The poor boy? Not your brother. Someone else who wishes to rekindle us.
Go, my eyes. Almost there. Rest now. Soon you'll be up and about again. Alfida! Did they hurt you? Takes more than some cockshy milksops to break my will. Beating a boy after death for stealing bread? I'll not see it done. Growling bellies mean nothing to those pay swords. Ellerich, pay more mind to the world. It is cruel and dark for those who cannot stand up for themselves. Alvida, could we speak in private? He is a good boy. But without a father to guide him, he's grown softer than I'd hoped. I found him cowering like a frightened pup near your house. He may need a firmer hand. You would judge us? My parents died and left me alone with a babe when I was little more than a girl myself. Now speak plain, why have you come for me? I am here at the request of Elderman Beerston. He wonders if you could love him again. Love him? Dear old Beerston, he remembers. He does. I've thought of him sometimes myself. But with my brother to fend for, I could not waste a life mooning. He has thought of nothing but you, Alvida. And with his wife Estrid returning to Frankia, he sent me to find you. How it would work between me and him? I'm a poor woman. Have been always. But the elder man... Oh, God, help me! I'll give him a go. How could I not? Oh, bless. He will come if you call. At the lighting of the bonfire, he will ride here to meet you. Ellerich! Come you and sit with us. I have something to say. My... My apple blossom girl. Is it really you? It is. Though crows have left their footfalls around my eyes. They still shine brightly. As when we were children. Has Eivor told you all? Aye, she has. And do you accept me, love? My heart feels like it will burst.
And this young lad is Elevich, Olvida's brother. Hello, your... your... worshipfulness? I am Beerstan, nothing more or less. And you are a fine, strong lad of... how old? Nineteen summers. He's all the family I have, Beerstan. If I'm to stay, you must welcome us both into your heart. We have one half of our bargain done, Beerstan. I will return with news of the other. Does this mean we're leaving Malden? You are, my boy. To live with me in Colchester. Perhaps I can teach you the joy of the hunt. Before you go, Elovrich, I would suggest a long, slow walk around the lake. I should leave them to their reunion. The next piece of this drama is the kidnap in Colchester. Dear Beerston, I cannot believe you would come for me after all these years. I never stopped thinking of you, Alvida. The festival is underway. I should speak to Rolo about our plan. Go, Sunan.
Show me what lies ahead.
How are your people, Rolo? Recovered and ready for what tonight holds? Gerhild's treachery was a blow. Few were surprised it came to that, only that her dark ways took such a brutal turn. Put that aside. We're ready now. What would you have of us? Unleash your war dogs. Set things afire. Bring panic. Act like the barbarians they think us to be. We'll stick their hearts with needles of fear. Night will fall soon. Then is our moment to strike. Yes, I agree. The planets we wear wuna. Killing is dumas sit aya sine. Raurum huse. I wanted to wear a garland of meadow sweet in my hair. They say it will bring you your true love. Odin owns you all. Cower before your masters. Dogs, the Lady of Essex is ours. Coming with me! Oh, oh, this is you, foul day! Guards! Oh, woe unto me! Put me down! Odin's beard! 
You wouldn't fool a child with that howling. Unhand me, fiend! Stand down, you Saxon dogs! The Lady of Essex is ours! Guards! Guards! Safe enough to walk, I think. Aren't we? Oh, what a thrill! My heart is racing! Now you pay for your sins! Oh, what a thrill! My heart is racing! Be glad it still beats at all. Your screaming drew half the guards in Colchester down upon us. I wanted to give a good performance. My father always said I was quite the actor. I good. won't deny your enthusiasm. Did you not have even a little fun? To steal away a princess. It did give a thrill. A woman fights bravely against her abductors, yet... You killed him! Die! fights bravely against her abductors. Yet, what will they do with me now? Is my virtue safe? Done. And all that stands between me and my home now is a foaming ribbon of surf and silt. You did well, Rollo. You and your people. Are you ready to sail? Loki's hissing sun churns the waters between our coasts. We'll need time to rest as we wait for fairer weather. Have a care, then. Alfred's soldiers will be looking for Estrid, even if beer stands will not. Now's not the time for such worries, A4. Tonight, we celebrate. Let's get you some mead. Beerstan will meet you northeast of Colchester tomorrow. You have earned all my husband promised, and more. Come find me, if you like, away from these reveling Danes. Thunder. I should find Piston. No doubt he's hunting again.
Have a look, Sunan. There, there, old hound. Hold your faith, for soon we'll be hunting. Beerston, Estrid said you'd be here. Eivor, dear heart, you who drew back the bow of Eros and reunited me with my one true love. Have your thanes asked why you do not look for Estrid? Pish. They have asked, yes. I said it was hopeless. Then I lay upon my couch, sobbing and wailing. A pretty show. That may not be enough. Tut tut. The wind is soft upon our faces, and I am far from the whispering doors of Colchester. Come, let's hunt! What are we hunting now? Boar! A majestic animal, don't you think? Driven by a fierce fire, blazing eyes, and sword tusks. I once knew a strong armed shield maiden who rode a boar into battle. She named it Bristlebolt. How wondrously strange! Your tales are worthy of the hearing. We'll not ride our boars, but eat them. A feast in Alvida's honor. A feast for your mistress. Beerston, if this ruse falls apart, King Alfred will strip you of your title. Our alliance will be worthless. Have no fear. I shall be discreet. We will eat and sup at my hall with a few friends and family. It is there our friendship will be sealed. So soon after Lamas. Will people there not recognize me? No, you are just one more day. And in that chaos, who remembers anything but the screams of dear Estrid? These are your lands. I trust in your judgment. And how is Alvida? She is a firebrand. We have rekindled our love as if we were teenagers. Even Ellerich is a welcome addition. A younger brother to me. Yet... More alike to a son.
I should like to teach him. Ah, this is the spot. The best boar here. This table won't fill itself. Sunan, guide me. This table won't fill itself. They are fearsome beasts, but tasty. Make a delicious roast. <laughs> Come on, the feast table won't fill itself. won't fill itself. This table won't fill itself. I shall suck the scrumptious marrow from your bones, you porcine devil! My bow arm aches. We did well, Avor. A good hunt, Beerston. And enough for one day, I think. Even my thanes will not go hungry with this catch, and they are as voracious as wolves snatching at my carcass. They may give you grief, but I have been nothing but amused. They're a welcome change to worrying Jarls and piss sudden politics. You have brought us all true happiness, Eivor. I thank you from the bottom of a heart full up with joy. Beerstan, the heart hound who sought his true love by searching the sad haven of his memory and finding her there. Beautifully said, my friend. Beautifully said. Come, Percy, you hapless hound. Barely a boar worried. I do not know why I keep you in my employ. <laughs> what are your plans for Essex and your family? There is much that is new in this old fling. 
Alvida is changed. The girl I fell in love with died. Hurry back, Birsten. I will join you later for the feast. If they see me, messy. Cast about this land, my friend. You promised we would never be apart, not for one waking or sleeping moment, and already you're sneaking out to hunt. Ha ha ha! For the feast, sweetling. We owe our mutual friend a great debt, one that I promised to repay over suckling pig and ale. Sister, have you forgotten where you are? I have a right to happiness, Elreach. Or am I to play nursemaid forever, you ungrateful pup? Happiness, yes. But you embarrass yourself nightly, heaving and sweating with this hamhock! Hold your tongue, boy. Lest we both speak our truths. What truth have you to speak? That you've returned to this fickle man who abandoned you years ago for a Frankish pet? A woman he paid this dame to abduct in that lamish shadow play? Mind yourself, boy. Or that you let him sniff and paw you and take him to your bed on the promise of nothing? The whole of Essex whispers now. He's married still, his wife freshly stolen, and you are no more than... than his... I am the mother of his child, you whelp! Child? Alvida? 
Please, my boy, I... I... I will never forgive you for this. Never. <laughs> my lord, joyous news. God smiles upon us this very day. Estrid has been found by Alfred's men. They ride to her rescue as we speak. I will not let this plot be undone. Nothing is safe till they are away to Frankia. I will fix this, and one day I will call on you, and you will come. You can count on it, my friend. I wanted to tell you so many times. Hush, Angel. Do not fret so. He hates me! Sound almost human, but cards. Estrid is so close to freedom. I hope I'm not too late. Lork, stand by Estrid. Guard her with your life. If she's taken, all is lost for us and Beeston. Come, lady. It would not do for them to take you back. Watch out! Lork! Hold it now!
Estrid, I promised I would free you of your life in Wessex. Frankia awaits your return. Go now, with Aegir's blessing. I will miss you, Eivor. When winter is past, summer will come, and wind you in a flowered skirt. For you are beauty, and shall not wither. Goddess Freya, give me more of that. Come, take care of her, Rollo Stoutheart. And if you find yourself on England's shores again, I will expect you in my hall. Good. They are safe. Birsten got his end of the bargain, and Estra is to Frankia. I should return to Ranvi.
Aria Salve, Evo. What did you do? In Essex, I played a matchmaker and a heartbreaker. An easy way to forge an alliance. But let us stick to war and diplomacy. Understood. Thank you, Eivor. I want to see the Alliance map. My mind is fixed on Sussex. Bassam and I have a chance to save Sigurd. But we will need an army. That is for you to decide. The more alliances you have, the better your chances at victory. I will go now. And I'll bring Sigurd back with me. That is a promise. Good. I will send word to our allies at once. Meet with Basim when you can. He should be in Croydon by now. Come to me. This place is heavily guarded. Red basket of Wessex, land of plenty. Mm. It's burned. 
shoulder break. What's wrong, Tola? Stretch your wings, Sunan. Flames. Well, that side, we are making great strides to improve the lives of its people. You wouldn't be the first man to fall asleep on watch, but you would be the loudest. I did not mean to fail you, Gudrun Jarl. It was only for a moment. I was so tired. As are we all, boy. We marched hard to get here. Still, <gasps> let's not disappoint me again. You hear? My Jarl, I'm sorry. You must be Eivor. I've heard much of you, young one. They say you're something. We'll see. Guthrum Jarl, Saxon Bane and Reaver of the South. I am honored to meet you at last. Respect where it's due. I like that. Here's hoping you fight as smoothly as you talk. Aver hopes to rescue Sigurd from the madwoman Fulke, now ensconced in Porchester Fortress. If you wish to crown yourself King of Wessex, Porchester must fall. An alliance here serves us both. You promised a great army, but you couldn't breach a Kron's garden with what you have assembled here. This is not the sum of my forces. Where are the rest? Your allies are on their way. We must be patient. We cannot wait for them. We march as soon as we are able. With these numbers, are you keen to see Valhalla today? I'll not sit on my heels while Sigurd rots in that she dog's care. We might muster for an attack in the woods east of Porchester. But there are scouts between there and here. Scouts I can manage. Point me at them and I will blind Fulke's eyes. One walks the road between Briggsworth and Chichester. Another on the riverbank north of Crowley. A third keeps watch on the hills south of Croendene. But I warn you, these are all we know of. There may be more. A risk we must take. I will find the scouts. You move the men into position near Porchester. That is a rash gamble, Ravenfear. If we are spotted, we will be vulnerable. If you want victory, come now or not at all. Every hour we waste could be Sigurd's last. You had better be all they promised. 